All right, boys. So Pokemon Unite got released on mobile. I know some people will want to play on PC, so this video goes out to all the homies who want to play on PC. For this, you obviously need an emulator. I will be using BlueStacks for the sake of this tutorial. However, I will leave two alternatives in the description below. Now, what you need to do, do first is go to the link that I've left, download BlueStacks or the emulator of your choice. Press on download BlueStacks. Assuming you already have it downloaded and installed, you need to go to the app itself and just open it. Right, it has loaded. As you can already see, I have Pokemon Unite installed. However, since you won't, you need to go to the Play Store, type Pokemon Unite. It's already out and just click on this green button install. It's like you're playing on your phone, essentially. Right. So, all right, we've downloaded it. Everything is good. But how do we, how do we set it up to play on PC? Well, I'll show you in a second. You know, on this channel, we just cut straight to the chase, not trying to waste your time and stretch this video out to eight minutes so I can put more ads in. But if you guys could like and subscribe, that'd be greatly appreciated. All right, so now we're just gonna go into a practice battle. Where were they? Practice, practice area. All right. I will show you my personal keybinds and you guys can decide for yourselves what you wanna use and what's more most comfortable for you. Right. So first we're gonna go to the sidebar. If it's not popped up for you, you just need to press these two arrows and it's gonna show up. All right, so go to game controls, on screen controls, so you can see everything, right? So you wanna decide first if you're gonna use a gamepad or keyboard and mouse. I will be using keyboard and mouse. Now we press advanced editor. So, what you need to do first is get one of these D-pads. I personally use a D-pad and how you put it, you just drag and drop it over here. Now, the buttons that will be used for this are W, A, S, and D. It's like you're moving in any MMORPG, right? Now, next up, let's close this for a second and look at how many skills we have. So pretty much we have uh, our skill to base, we have to cap our points and two basic skills, one basic attack and one ultimate skill. So we need to keep buying all of these. We go back to these game controls, open advanced editor, tap spot. Now you drag and drop one of these. You need one, two, three, four, five, six of these. You drag and drop them and make sure you put them on the skill itself or on the thing you want to press. We drag and drop them. Now, if you're having issues and your keyboard does not want to function uh, like that if you're trying to key bind it. Chances are you probably have a gamepad uh, or a game controller connected as well. So you need to go to this tiny little settings option. If you're selected, if you have gamepad selected, you need to go to keyboard and mouse and just key bind it to the button that you want. So for example, my basic attack is Q. Just Q. Right. So I'm not going to save these settings because I already have it key binded. But essentially what you need to do is do that for every single skill. And if you have put the D-pad as well as these skills, you'll be able to move, right? Basic attack with Q. It works. Your skill, if you want to aim it, you have to use your mouse and also the key bind. So mine is F, like that, we shoot. Electroweb, again, E, and we aim it with the mouse and we release. And of course our ultimate skill is R. If you want a base, just press B. It's like in leak, or so I've done it. And if you want to cap your points, it's C for me, but you can keep bind it however you like, right? So essentially what you need to do is, again, game controls, advanced editor, you put one D-pad over here and you put one, two, three, four, five, six tap spots, and you just key bind each of them to the letter or part of the keyboard that you want. And that's pretty much how I play Pokemon Unite on PC. Yeah, I hope you guys got something out of this tutorial. Like I said, like, sub, and I'll see you next time. Bye, boys.